Welcome to the Savage Productions YouTube channel. Hey, once again, thanks for checking out this video. So uh, today, I was going to do a little preview and a little walk around with this sweet 86 Fox behind me here. This has got a 408 stroker in it. So the story is on this, the guy that owns it now bought it from somebody that actually built the car or had it built or whatever. The part number of the rotating assembly that is in this block with the heads that are on it, I checked it out and it comes in at around 12 and a half to one compression, give or take. That's too much for 93 octane. It's not too much for 93 octane with the proper tune. The problem is with the tune file that this Holly's got in it, the base tune file, the total timing is too high. Um, these like to run around 28, 29 degrees. The 408s do. Any more than that, they don't really make any more power. They actually will lose a little bit of power. Now, with 93 octane, 11 to 1 compression or lower, you're going to be good at 28, 29 degrees timing. You start shooting above that, you need to have total timing down. Um, 24 degrees, 25 degrees total maybe. No different than having a boosted car. Boost makes compression, right? High compression NA, same deal. So this thing has got to be seeing knock. It's got to be. So I've sent a message to Adam at s and Motorsports, local guy here that tunes. He's a Holly certified tuner. I want to try to get the customer set up with him so he can actually tune this thing drivability be so much better it actually run better and it'll be safe so anyway enough of the talking let me um do a little walk around here i'm going to show you this car man it's, it's really a sweet car let's check it out so i actually i don't have it in the sun because the wind i've got it kind of blocked behind my trailer because the wind was a little breezy earlier and the wind noise was awful but it's still i mean it's it's just a sweet looking ride um just do a little walk around here let you see it got a little sunshine on this side I've had people come by the shop and look at this thing, man. They just, they just love it. Love the way it looks. Let's do the inside here. I'm gonna open this door up. The inside of this thing is so clean. I mean, it's definitely look. It's got new. It's got new uh, seals right there. Obviously, those are brand new. You can tell. New felt in the doors. Yeah, somebody spent some money on this thing. Even got weather stripping, new weather stripping on the doors. You can see all that. The sunroof, original sunroof. Looks like they didn't replace the, the rubber there, or the seal, I should say. But the inside. I don't know if that's original dash, but it is in great shape the whole inside is i mean look at the door panels these have maybe these are replaced i mean they're just you know these are these were bad about sagging so uh yeah these these door panels have probably been replaced let me get back a little bit and see the whole door panel i mean it basically just looks brand new now these seats are probably original they're in also they're they're great shape they're usually they'll right here they'll they'll uh tear and you can see where somebody had stitched this back up but they did a pretty good job and then i know they always get a hole in them right here but i don't know that anybody's repaired that or not it's got <clears throat> the seats in the back are, are good nice and clean i mean all the, the plastic panels 
I don't know if they've been re-dyed or anything. Headliner. Yeah, those must have been replaced. They look almost new. Yeah, I would say these have been replaced. Somebody spent some money on this car. I forget what he paid for it. He bought this thing from a guy that he's got the kick panels off. Um, and the reason why is because when the car shut down, it shut down on him. He had to have it towed here. <clears throat> he was checking a few things, I guess, to try to get it started back up. That's why the kick panels are off. I don't know where they're at. I would put them back on for him, but uh, he must have them at the house. But yeah, the dash looks really nice too. It's got a nice stereo in it. Nice stereo there. <clears throat> Let me uh, pop the hatch here so you can see this. It does have electric hatch. It's got the electric uh, hatch release. It's got the electric uh, fuel door release. So it's, it's pretty much a loaded up GT for 86. He's got a battery location kit there. Yeah, you see it's... So he doesn't have this piece here. These actually had a, a plastic panel that covered here. But when they painted it, they painted the, uh, the whole thing, didn't they? They got it all. I don't know if you can... Yeah, you can see it right there. They painted the uh, inside of the hatch and everything. I'll go ahead and shut this. All right, now we're going to pop the hood. <clears throat> Let you check the motor out. Open these up. So it doesn't have a, a hood release on it. That's the only thing that's holding it is them locks right there. Let me pop this, put the hood prop up here. So they, uh, you, as you can see, it's a, it is a 408 stroker. It's got uh, Ford Performance Z heads. It's got a Trick Flow R intake. It's got a 80 millimeter AccuFab throttle body with a EGR plate. Anderson Motorsports power pipe. It's got the high amp alternator and bracket. It's got this um, delete. AC delete pulley which um, there's another way of doing that you know honestly you could probably not have that and do the relocation of the power steering pump but um, looks like they got a new master cylinder and power booster there I actually installed this coil while it was in here they had the stock coil mounted up underneath the fender well that's where all the wires are ran. And um, there was a stock coil. So I went ahead and put an MSD coil on it right there. Made up a Taylor Big 10.2409 race wire. So uh, yeah, it's pretty sweet, man. Pretty sweet. The only thing about this one is it's got shorty headers on it. I'm not really sure why somebody would go through all of this work and put shorty headers on it they should put long tubes it'd be uh so much better but yeah man that's it it's nice i love this car it doesn't have the uh fog lights or the the turn signal lights in there i did see the plugs for them just hanging i don't know what's going on there i have to ask them about that but uh yeah he's going to be doing some uh some stuff to it you know improvements still got a little bit to go on this thing all in all it's it's a nice car it really is you know i've had a lot of these uh 85 86 four eyes back in the day and um you know i just i'm just i just like them you know they look cool so uh anyway i just wanted to do a little walk around review on this car I uh, thought about taking it for a little ride so let's um, 
let's do that. Let me go ahead and shut this hood and we'll take it for a ride. All right, I've already got it fired up. We're gonna take it for a little ride. It, it's a little, uh, it's a little uh, throttle responsive there. Like I say, it, it does need a good tune. It's it's uh, it's still kind of learning since I got it running again. But gotta be easy right here. It's uh, it could use a good tune, man. Help with drivability out for sure. Plus, this thing's just got too much timing in it for what it is. Get that octane up. 
Yep, so uh, I took it for a ride earlier, make sure everything was good on it. Um, I just went this little back road, turned around, came right back. I didn't go on the long drive like that, but it seems like it's doing good. Man, it looks good though. Check it out. That, that gray and black looks freaking pretty nice, man. All right, so <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and end it here. Appreciate you guys checking this one out. That brings back old memories man not the color but the car so good deal i appreciate you guys checking it out um you know give me a like thumbs up share whatever um thumbs down you know whatever y'all think and uh be sure to check out you know some other videos that i'll be uh putting out on this channel and uh i appreciate it we'll see you on the next video